Well, hello everyone. I am coming to you with major, massive Hogwarts mystery news. We've had all sorts of news, uh, some not so good, some kind of okay with the other Harry Potter games, but Hogwarts mystery, the long-awaited year eight, aka, or as they are calling it, expansion is coming. Uh, looks like it will start in July. Uh, so you still have time more than expected the kind of rumored date for the release of year 8 was actually June 7th I think but now they've actually made it clear that it's gonna be in July so you have more time to finish year 7 though there are still more content coming Nudes the actual proper time limit side quest is coming soon as well they have been like pre test preparing for Nudes but the actual Thing hasn't happened yet but it is coming that will happen so let's just go through quickly the announcement that they have made and so the whole message is basically that players will be able to embark on a monumental adventure beyond Hogwarts so for one you will actually be able to graduate and we will see the graduation ceremony which we haven't seen in any harry potter game i don't think because we haven't seen it in either the books or the movies either uh, so the story continues beyond hogwarts uh, this massive expansion provides a lot of exciting content 25 plus new chapters in volume one so there will be multiple volumes uh coming 20 plus aged up characters. We've seen glimpses of some of the characters finally looking age appropriate. Then we've got 15 plus new environments, which is a lot of locations actually. Uh, then 14 plus repeatable projects. Interesting, not sure exactly what that stands for. Maybe time limited side quests, uh, we'll see. Uh, plus 25 plus new repeatable social encounters. Okay, so those would be the friendship activities I guess there will be slightly different uh, types as the locations would, I would assume, change. Nothing in Hogwarts, etc. So new mysteries, so exploring new locations. Uh, bustling city of London will be one of them. And we will also encounter some new and familiar faces along the way. So that is cool. Players will choose a neighborhood decorate their first flat and start a top secret career. Almost, almost skipped over that one. That's interesting. The quest to solve magical mysteries will continue after getting recruited by Marai Moody into a top secret new role. In it, players will have access to the new specializations feature, allowing them to shape how they play and which path they'd like to pursue. Ooh, that's new to Hogwarts mystery for sure. Um, let's see, let's see. So all grown up, yep, aged up for the first time indeed within the seven years that we have in Hogwarts mystery. Uh, characters have not been aged uh, even once. Then we'll also reconnect with old friends and find out what they've been up to since graduation. Uh, also, the Hogwarts adventure isn't over. As Dumbledore says, help will always be given at Hogwarts to those who ask for it. While players seek adventure beyond the school grounds, the story will bring them back to Hogwarts where they'll continue to interact with fan favorite canon professors and characters. Um, and that leads to why in some of the da uh, Datamine Prophet editions we've actually seen young Harry because as it's stated, uh, the class of 91, so the players here, their graduation marks a passing of the torch to a new class of first years and players will soon do just that as they help to prepare the incoming class acceptance letters. They may even see a few familiar names. So chronologically, I think it means Harry. And for those currently playing, something to keep in mind. So log in and play every day between now and July 27th to collect graduation themed rewards and prepare for life beyond Hogwarts. So yeah, that's what's going on. Not necessarily a big surprise because we kind of already knew that year eight was going to happen. We didn't know what it would look like. So this actually does provide more information. Uh, for example, that there will be multiple volumes, as they will be called. And now, if you're still like very passionate about Hogwarts Mystery, this is something that will kind of keep you going. And maybe this will kind of re-spark your interest, though it does seem like you will have to first graduate. So you have to get through all the seven years to reach this new expansion. That's a bit of a shame. Um, since it's such a new version of the game, it would be cool 
for people to actually be able to access it and no matter what because getting through those seven years is so painful so hard so grinding it would be cool to have like a way to skip that uh, but yeah let me know what you think of this are you excited for now thanks for watching and i'll see you next time bye